Lovelies, it's Sarcasm the Sickness, and welcome back to the 31 Day Challenge. Today is day 23, and um, yeah, I'm excited. I I actually am pretty excited for today. This is this is a fun one. I'm really interested in. Or I'm really hoping that this drawing turns out well. Um, quickly before I go into what today is and uh, my poke my pick for today. Uh, let's talk about the other YouTuber lovelies who are also doing the 31 day challenge on their channels Unknown Persona, Kuru Ryushin, Jimf, Apple Pie Queen, Master Lax, Liger Zero, Chespin Jr. 98, Glix Alt, Dueling Gentleman, Adora Shinx, and Brother Gumi. Please go visit their channels, leave likes on their, on their videos, and yeah, just generally be awesome. I'm sure they appreciate it. I know I do. Um... As I said, today is day 23, and that is favorite single stage Pokemon. So that is any Pokemon that does not evolve or evolve from something. So, like, you know, so like Apom would have been a single stage Pokemon back in Gen 2, but in Gen 4 they gave it an evolution, Ambipom, so that would no longer count. Um, by po yeah, like any Pokemon that evolves into something. Like Charmander evolving to Charmeleon doesn't count, and any Pokemon that evolves from something like Charizard evolving from Charmeleon also doesn't count. So it's you know it's like your Kecleons, it's your um, it's your um. Of course, I can't think of any now. Shuckles, it's your freaking you know, it's like unknown and things like that. It's it's Pokemon that don't have an evolutionary line. They're just they're all by themselves, like far fetched or something, just chilling, man. And um, yeah, and my favorite single stage. Pokemon is Furfru. I really like Furfru. Um, yes, it's good. It's a good one. Um, yeah, let me grab my timer real quick. I forgot to do that while I was rambling. And there we go. Okay. Now, hopefully this will only take two. I do kind of want to draw both forms, uh, mainly because the one is two colors, so it's really not going to take that long, hopefully. But yeah, we'll see. Um, anyway, three, two, one. Ah. Okay, um, Furfru is definitely one of those Pokemon that I was excited about when I when I saw it. Um, I really like its. I just I like its design. I think it's really cute. I'm not exactly like a dog person or anything, but I do I do really like Furfru. I think it's adorable. Um, back in X and Y, I did spend a long time learning how to do the um, learning how to do the. Um, the Pokey Radar shiny hunting method, just so that I could shiny hunt a Furfru, and it took forever. It took so many tries to get it right, um, but I was able to get actually two Furfrus using this method. One for myself and one for a friend. Um, oh my god, I can't even tell you how long that took. That was ridiculous, and I was so excited when I actually finally got them. So Furfru is definitely, um, definitely important to me. Um, I love fur- I love using Furfru in battle. Fur coat is really obnoxious, especially when combined with, um, with Cotton Guard and stuff. But it also has some pretty decent, like, offensive capabilities too. So, it's- it's just a cool Pokemon. Um, I'll admit, when I first saw that it, like, had all these different, like, haircuts and stuff, at least the first three that they showed, I was just kind of like, uh, that's cute, I guess. It's like a poodle thing, I guess. I don't know, whatever. And I was kind of not interested. Um, but then when I saw, like, the other cuts, I actually did get really interested at that point. Like, I, like the one that you're seeing there, I think it's like a Kabuki or something. I can't remember what it's called. Ah, oh, that's not what it's called. I can't remember what it's called. But um, that is my favorite cut that is that you're seeing there. So, um, so yeah, definitely um, when I saw the other ones, I really like the Pharaoh cut, too. That's probably my second favorite. Um... But yeah, I do like the haircuts they, that they get. It, I think it's pretty neat. I think it's cute to be able to customize them and stuff. You know, or like, you know, you like you pick your favorite when you bring it into battle and stuff, which is really nice. Uh, the only problem, I guess, is that it isn't permanent and that you can't, like... It's just, yeah, it's just really annoying that, um... That, like, if you, okay, god forbid you put it in the PC once, now you have to go pay $500 to freaking... Or, yeah, 500 Pokey, whatever, to go get its haircut again. It's just, that's kind of obnoxious. I really wish that they had kept it, like, like, you know, like, 
just at least like semi-permanent in a way, but they didn't, so that was weird. Um, but yeah, I think it's- I just think it's really cute and I think it really has some- I really like it's um, I guess it's just competitive viability. Just its ability to be kind of obnoxious. Um, other single stage Pokemon that I was considering, I guess, we'll move on to that. Um, I don't know, this- Furfur was kind of, uh, like, kind of the first one that came to mind for me. There really wasn't- there really aren't too many that- like, cause other po other single stage Pokemon that I really like, I've already showcased, like Kecleon. Um, so yeah, I mean, like, I guess I like Zangoose, I do. Um, so Viper's actually pretty cool too. Mm, trying to think of others. It's really- it's really hard to think about. Aerodactyl's cool. Aerodactyl is really cool. Um, yeah, ugh, why is that so hard for me to think about? It's just, I don't really- I don't- I guess there's not a lot of single-stage Pokémon that I really think about. And then a lot of single-stage Pokémon also happen to be legendaries. So there's that. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I've seen- I have seen, like, a lot of your suggestions are- or your favorites, not suggestions. Your favorites already, and, um, I see, like, you know, there was Shuckle, somebody said Unknown, somebody said Kecleon. Um... I had to, I'm actually really surprised at how many people do like Shuckle. I don't know why. I mean, I know it's- it's kind of cute, I guess. And it's kind of... Yeah, I guess it's kind of cute. Um, wow, I really did not leave myself enough room to draw the other fur through. Um, oh well. Here goes nothing, I guess. You know what, forget it, I'm just gonna draw the one. Um, I've already gone over my five minutes. And, um, I really- I didn't plan enough room for the second one to be drawn, so I guess it's just regular furfru, even though- I mean, I guess you guys get to see what my favorite furfru cut is. That's great, I guess. Um, I don't know. I will see you tomorrow with day 24, which is- crap, I looked it up at the beginning and now I don't remember what it is. Oh, it's favorite Pokemon design. It is favorite Pokemon design, which is gonna be an interesting one because honestly, I picked a lot of these Pokemon because I like the design. Like a lot of these were specifically chosen because I like the design. So um, that's gonna be a fun one. You get to see what my favorite design is out of all of the ones that I've already picked. And um, I can't wait to see yours, honestly. That is, that's a highly interesting topic for me. Um, yeah, thanks for joining me today and I'm sorry that I didn't draw everything that I said I was gonna draw. Oh well. Um, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!